Hey there on the Cell Calvin Super Demo World, and we have arrived and even began Ice World, the world of ice. Let's go in numerical order, I guess. Even though this does bring me to a red level, which is pretty scary to think about, but I just kicked that guy in the face. Did it. Dagadon. Yeah, I kind of want those Dagadon. So is it going to be something regular? That if there's little icicles, that means that that's where a power-up might be hidden? Because that has been pretty consistent. I'm just kind of jumping here. Don't mind me, it's just Lakitu. I think I missed him. It's just Lakitu. Good for him, if I missed him. I, oh, jeez. Everything is getting pretty cluttered. But now I just stole his cloud. I don't want it. Yeah, oh, star. That's kind of scary to think about. I want more speed. Like, I want to be able to just go and not go in this pipe. And just run. And, you know, and bop some guys. I can, like, get a one-up this way, maybe. Ugh. So there's a path down there. Maybe you bring the cloud there, and that's where another exit is. It's possible. Yeah, I'm gonna get all the dagon on. I'm gonna slard kill a porcupine. Like everything happened in these windy mill. It's not windy at all. It's snowy though. It's snow up to your waist. Yet still you advance with the force of a thousand snakes. That's how you count forces, not who uses Newton? No one. Alright, so theory, you go in that little lower part that you would easily have access to if you can rob a guy's cloud and drive it there. An activity I spent a big chunk of yesterday doing, so yeah, you know. So yeah, there's a spot where... Like, I do want to... Well, I did want to use my ability to breathe fire from my hands to steal the cloud forever. But there's a distinct possibility that was was made with the idea that you wouldn't do that. But like, yo, no, 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 all right. Okay, Blackatu, I need you to respawn. I didn't burn you, which means you can't come in. There you go, see, you're right there. Perfect. Um, dang it. Uh, yeah, no. It, yeah, no, yeah, no. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah, no. There we go. There we go. Managed to find my way around. Now we can see the cloud smile through the tree, <laughs> as they do. That's why clouds are required to stay above a certain height in the sky. It's because seeing trees smile like that would just freak people out. Oh, I don't know where the lock is, though. Well, I have a cloud. I have the means to escape. Maybe not the time, but I have the means to uh, not escape, explore. Basically the same thing. Let's look for a lock. I'm gonna start by looking up here, and then we're gonna work our way around. Uh, I guess. I mean, that's the advantage. Like, that's the fun part of an infinite length cloud. I'm more worried about the actual timer time than my cloud now. Cloud is so slow. Like, it has many things to do. Like, I'm kind of curious about the tall pits at the start of the level, which is why I kind of started heading here first. I want to go to the very first, and then look from there. Because also, you know, there's a possibility that they might just hide it, like, high up somewhere. It's totally within this game's character. Like, these tall pits here. Now look at that. You can very safely put something at the bottom, man. No one would ever hear about it until it was too late. Which is why it is my duty to go down pet. Ah, see, look at that. Look at that. I've played at least one other ROM hack ever. That's when you learn about these things. You just pick up these habits. This lay ground the foundation to the blue switch pals. I didn't expect that though. All right. Whoa, uh, maybe you don't want to touch these. Like, maybe they're gonna turn into, yeah, blocks that enable you to get this like that, huh? Yeah, that's right. You put those coins there to tempt you as you go like, mmm, delicious coins. Uh, 
I will fill my belly tonight, says Mario, but it turns out, no way, guy. You're doing the wrong thing. You got to suspend your immediate happiness so that you can be happier at a later date. That is something children are, Ill are literally impossible for them to do up to a point because it necessitates a certain like brain formation. Because man, does it take a long while for the brain to finish brain. What am I even saying? It doesn't matter. Here's a yellow dot. Ice World 3 for you and me. It's Donkey Kong Country. Oh, the ice. It brought me forward. And I got hurt. All oh, people are here still. Yep, that was some bad placement timing on my end. Can't bring anything but me to a crowd of jelly belly. We're gonna climb. People put sticks on the side of this mountain, it makes it easier to climb up. Thank you, mysterious benefactor! Don't burn these ice, cause there's munchers inside! Look. See, there we go. Proof of concept right there. Floating munchers, this will never be accepted. And sumarcentral.net. Here we go, we're on that icicle. Looking down down and... Uh, oh, there we go. Yeah, that's right. By sliding on my butt, my head is invincible. And, oh, wow. And if you don't keep your fire somehow, I guess you die? <laughs> rude, but... Oh, this is also pretty rude. This is legitimately pretty scary. Can I do that jump from here? Sure can. Alright, so yeah, just keep your fire about and then they give you, you know, like, oh, you want to fry this turtle, but then you might make the platforming more difficult. See, I don't want to throw fire in case I end up making something harder. I like, ended up not being an issue, but it could have been. It didn't a bomb fell on me. Ah, uh, dang it, then I jumped right up into that guy for some reason. I just couldn't help myself. Coins on the side. We don't even know why. This game has, like, no midpoints ever. <laughs> like, way at the start? And in the castle where you gotta kill yourself? That's about it? Like, this is, it's okay. Like, it, I, I mean, the levels are not super long for the most part. Nonetheless, oh, now we're gonna get judged by the snowman. This is it. This is the real ice level. This is where things get serious. The sky is teal. We're like on a chalkboard. And the ice is actually chalk. Do the chalk zone. Here we go. Bop this thing, there's gonna be a bind. It's frigid, it doesn't wanna be here at all. Here's a pipe though, full of calcium nitrate. I don't know, that's a real chemical compound you can have. It doesn't matter, I'd rather have ice. I want further control over my jump, over the ability to defrost a block or two. Okay, there's probably stuff below, but if you're giving me a top choice, it's almost always the path you want to take. It's just safer. And here you get another feather, and you get Space Moon, Frosty Moon, here we go. Eat a tube. How are you got that diagonal? I don't know. There's like a whole universe. Oh. Alright, I didn't beat the level yet. I can't start select. I, I took a chance. I didn't know how down the thing was scrolling. I made a mistake. Like, that's that's the... all of it. Like, really, there's, there's nothing more than that. I was, uh... The, uh, the, 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 what am I talking about here? The dragon coin, you know, it, it got my attention, and, uh, now I'm not gonna get the early dragon coin, so I'm not tempted anymore, you know? That's called knowing oneself and being smart about it. Maybe anyone can say whatever they want. It's really hard to say otherwise. I'm still gonna get that one night on, because it's not a, like, I'm not gonna go out of my way to avoid it. The moon is gone! There will be no more eclipse in the world. I still want to, like, you know, do jumps. I don't want to just fly. Flying above things I've already played is fine. Oh, that's interesting. So, you one, you need fire, and two, you need that P switch I saw, that silver P. So, wait, how does this work, though? How does this work? Ah, shoot. Well, not like that. Alright, so you're important. And also, somewhere, there's a P-switch. 
So this is the lower route, like, might as well go through it here. Nothing too special. How do you get down there? Like, there's a way to fly in there, but... Like, I wouldn't suggest it, but it doesn't... Huh. I need that silver piece. Unless you can just fly over the wall. Let's try that. Well... Oh. It worked! <laughs> I mean... No! I want to solve the level, but look, put that in your player's guide, though. That is totally something you can do. Yeah, the whole level is this puzzle of, like, what do you do? How do you do? There's a silver piece somewhere. Is there anything below here in this direction? Ugh, I mean... See, if I do that, I think I can... I think I can do it. So I feel like this here, this might be an attempt at a Yoshi filter. I don't think it is though. Now when I think about it, I'm like, well, I don't want to jump over a wall because I don't think that's what the author wanted. By that logic, I doubt bringing a Yoshi is also what was part of the plan. But I don't know, it feels a little bit better, I guess. At least I'm interacting with things. I don't know, I feel like I'm probably missing something somewhere. But, uh, it's fine. Is, uh, uh, I'm, I'm gonna say it's fine. <laughs> it's totally not, though. Alright, I'm sure someone will jump at the occasion of telling me or showing me any more genuine ways to beat the level. But I mean, I didn't cheat. I didn't bring anything outside the game. This was done entirely within the confines of what's in the game. Next time, the other path, I guess. Yeah, that, that's kind of logic.